Izvestia, Russian, Izvestia IPA, ZVSTJ, is a daily broadsheet newspaper in Russia. It was a newspaper of record in the Soviet Union from 1917 until the dissolution of the USSR in 1991. The word Izvestia in Russian means delivered messages, derived from the verb izveshchat, to inform, to notify. In the context of newspapers it is usually translated as news or reports. Topic <inaudible> Origin The newspaper began as the news of the Petrograd Soviet of Workers' Deputies on the 13th of March, OS the 28th of February 1917 in Petrograd. Initially, the paper expressed Menshevik and Socialist Revolutionary Party views. In August 1917, it took the title News of the Central Executive Committee of the Petrograd Soviet of Workers and Soldiers Deputies. By October 1917 it became News of the Central Executive Committee of the Soviets of Working and Military Deputies, and was eventually retitled News of the Soviets of People's Deputies. After the Second All-Union Congress of Soviets, Izvestia became an official newspaper of the Soviet government Central Executive Committee of the Supreme Soviet of the Soviet Union and Sovnarkom. History Topic. 1917–1991 During the Soviet period, while Pravda served as the official mouthpiece of the Communist Party, Izvestia expressed the official views of the Soviet government as published by the Presidium of the Supreme Soviet of the USSR. The full name was Izvestia Sovtov Narodnik Deputatov SSSR in Russian, Izvestia Sovtov Narodny Deputatov Tsar The Reports of Soviets of People's Deputies of the USSR. Topic 1992-present Following the dissolution of the Soviet Union, Izvestia now describes itself as a national newspaper of Russia. The newspaper was owned by a vast holding company of Vladimir Potanin which had close ties with the government. A controlling stake in Izvestia was purchased by state-owned Gazprom on 3 June 2005, and included in the Gazprom media holding. According to the allegations of the Committee to Protect Journalists, Raf Shakirov, editor-in-chief of Izvestia, was forced to resign because the government officials did not like the paper's coverage of the Beslan school hostage crisis. Other sources informed that Potanin had asked him to leave for fear the Kremlin would be riled by the explicit photographs of the massacre published by Izvestia. As of 2005, the circulation of Izvestia was 240,967. Its 2007 circulation certified by TNS Gallup Media was 371,000 copies. Until his death on 1 October 2008, the chief artist was Boris Yefimov, the centenarian illustrator who had worked as Joseph Stalin's political cartoonist. In 2008, Gazprom Media sold Izvestia to National Media Group. The newspaper was relaunched in D2 broadsheet format after that and adopted a new slogan, "Making Izvestia, i.e., reports from the news," as well as extended simultaneously its business coverage. The paper's old business section, Finansovi Izvestia, Finance Izvestia, was closed, and Marka Weekly was launched instead in September 2011, distributed with Izvestia on Mondays. The Friday appendix Nedelia, the week, devoted to culture and leisure activities, was relaunched as well. <laughs> 